Samsung RSH1 removal of the ice maker first take out the ice bucket dead simple lift and pull there's your ice maker at the top a couple of screws hold it in One more screw to go. As you undo this one, just be careful the ice maker doesn't drop. Just take the weight of it. There you can see. Just lower it down gently, pull it forwards, and there's the electrical plug. Unclip it and lift the ice maker away. To remove the ice maker from the housing, there's a tiny little sprung loaded clip there, clip it and the ice maker will slide upwards and away and then it's just a question of wiggling the ice tray out and the electrical lead comes out that hole. To refit it all would just be a, a reversal of that which we'll do now. So you've got your new ice maker thread the electrical connection through, put the spigot on the ice tray into its location once that's square relocate the ice maker and the sprung loaded clip and get your electrical connection threaded back through. There we go. To refit just offer it up you've got your electrical connections to do really important that the water spout goes through the hole at the back and that you don't knock it off just relocate it and put two screws back in really simple to fit so only a five minute job to replace the ice maker on a Samsung RSH1 just get the final screw in and then we'll put the water uh, the ice bucket back in place all nice and secure ice bucket just goes in easily and that's the job done